Yeah, it has the pure, see this is what we do now. We take the plant and you know how it has the crystals on it? I don't know, because I don't know anything about, well, well that's not true. Well, cannabis is very relevant now because it's legal in in Colorado. And, and uh, recently, it's going. To, um, Mayor Giuliano is uh, making it legal in New York. Mm -hmm. There's and, many states now that are mm -hmm. going for legalization of cannabis. So basically, what you end up with is something. This is just a little. Uh, oh, that's butter. like tar. It's yeah, we call it butter or over shatter. It's just basically pure THC without any of the plants. It smells aromatic. Oh. <laughs> Can I get high if I lick that? If you lick it, yeah. um, if any remains on your tongue and it dissolves in your blood system, probably. In, in a nutshell, why don't you do a monologue on cannabis and why you love cannabis and why, you know, why you're involved with it? Wow, Janice, this is very deep right here. Um, why I love cannabis? This is your to five minutes. Uh, <laughs> thank you. Um, cannabis is just an amazing plant that the only reason why it's illegal is because of our government in the 30s. Our uh, federal government decided to make it illegal because they needed to profit off of it. And I hate to throw booze under the table, but it's because of booze is why, why this why are you is throwing under the table? still illegal. Why are you throwing booze under the table? Uh, the, because we a lot of... We don't show up with little shady pieces of paper. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, you know, I, I got... got I we got show up with a nice bottle, a nice martini. Mm. Oh, yeah, well, well, well marketing and packaging for cannabis is changing now with legalities. But because a lot of these big... Uh, Companies that own alcohol, they have lots of lots and lots and lots of money, and they're very what everyone wants, and though. they're very influential on the political scene. So what they do is, you know, what do you think? I'm saying you that a lot of people would rather much. smoke cannabis than consume <laughs> alcohol. But um, <laughs> cannabis is very, it has a lot of medical benefits. It cures cancer. It actually like, kills cancer. Like what will it do for depression? It will make you happy. It does make you happy. Exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If you're um, what about sex? It oh. makes women uh, extra juicy? active. Yeah, <laughs> I need to be more women. juicy for sure. And there's many ways to consume cannabis, cannabis besides smoking it and eating a big fat brownie. I mean, there's you could actually make many meals with cannabis using oil or butter. So any food that can, that requires oil or butter, you can make. Well, you can into. buy off of that food. Of course. So like you make no, a can you, you make a cake to your grandmother. In like you know, chunk of cannabis oil, and then you you will have like a happy breakfast, a yes. happy meal. Yes. Hmm. People uh, at, and there's tinctures too. You get glycerin-based THC, and then put it in your drinks, your coffee, your tea. Let's your cocktail. try this. Like, what if I'm having a dinner party and I invite you over to you know to prepare the meal for everyone, and they you know you put on a, a nice white chef outfit, you're standing there with the booze, and we want you know this is a very you know uptight dinner. You could be doing the dancing. Oh, I'm, I'm seeing wow, this right now. Party. We're on the reality show. This is the show. And uh, I've got like three or four guests that are kind of like uptight. How do you dose someone without them knowing they're being dosed? Well, we could do some great pairings, I'm sure, like a wine and joint pairing, right. like the flavors yeah. of the joint with the wine, and maybe they, um, they'll enjoy that more. But the now way we could dose it? them, like the way like we could dose them, it into through food, through drinks, like you could put some in the, in the alcohol. Can you put a, is, there, is there an oil Teachers, you can yeah. put? Yes. Which would be the most? I sound like Borat. Which which would be the most? Uh, which would be the the most direct to the bloodstream route? To, you know, to get Probably that person a, to like give me a movie role. Uh, you could you could extract THC with alcohol as well to strip it from the plant, and then you could just drink there we it. Go. Drink it's a partnership. Straight. Yeah. Perfect partnership. You can, can you take it, put it in an iodine dropper, and yes. like just go like that with yes. people? Yes. Deftone. Put down the blunt. Janice, I love you. I love you. I miss you all day. Looking good. I miss them lips. Oh. Now we're oh. here. I love you. I love you. Come on, plant one. I love you, people. Oh. I love you. What about big barbell nipples? You want nipples? Nipples for cripples. Nipples. I want it all. For cripples. You can have them all. I'm not wearing a bra today. You have them all. You ain't wearing no panties either, huh? No, I never, I never wear no panties either. Damn. Damn, I know. That's what I know. What do you know? Coochie all out. Coochie all <laughs> up the Coochie. That's what I'm talking about. You get my nipples hard, girl. You got a question or you're just going to sit there yeah. in front? Let's get to it. Question. Put the blunt down. No, I, just want, I just wanted to call in and show my appreciation. Jenna, keep doing your thing, you old cougar. I am a cougar. Actually, my fiance is uh, 68 and I'm 58, so he's oh. older than me. Cat That's daddy. 
Huh? You got a cat daddy. I got a cat daddy. He's a cat daddy doctor. Yeah. Okay, so uh, some of these people would like to drink the cougar juice. Yes, it'll be available soon, and Janice Dickinson will be the face of it. So that will be perfect, right? Cougar rare. What's in the right. cougar juice? What does um, it taste like? It's like a, it's a passion fruit base ready to drink. So you just pick it up, you go pour it at your house, and it's ready. You don't have to be a mixologist. It's super easy. Hey, uh, bad Mitty, I would, I would, buy, I would uh, bowl you too. So, um, uh, Mr. Adam. Yes. Where were you? Where were you born? Out in the valley. Out in the valley. Yeah. And, and you, does your mom and dad know you're such, you're so big in the pot? Uh, yeah, of course. Now they have to. Do they also take, they smoke around um, like Thanksgiving dinner with you? Uh, you know, sometimes I give them a little treats if they need it. You know, everyone oh. consumes cannabis, Janice. It's I, not such a bad thing. I know everybody at least tried it once and are still doing it. I may it. have to take some home to the doctor, but he'd never smoke it. But maybe I can just... But it's legal now. What about a brownie? About a brownie? Why won't he smoke it? It's legal. A nice brownie. Uh, make Dessert him a nice brownie. pot brownie? Yeah. yeah. Did you that, make any? Did you have a recipe? We can make lots of edibles, yes. Last night we had red velvet cupcakes at the comedy show. Oh, nice. That's a secret level. it was funny. Nice. Yeah, it was funny. Yeah, they're great. You can make whatever you want. You're What's your favorite treat? My favorite treat is Hagen uh, chocolate peanut Medicated butter. Medicated ice cream. Medicated. Boom, done. Medicated ice cream. Ice cream too? Yes. You can do ice cream with weed. Cannabis ice cream. I had cannabis beef jerky. Were you uh, a dealer in high school? Yes. Nice. I sold. Is this where you made your, um, I, your fortune? I was, yeah, I was, you know, I was born Jewish, so I'm always about making money in business. Nice. So when I was in school, yes. people wanted some product, so I delivered the product. We love the Jews on this yes. show. Yes. It's exciting stuff. Uh huh. And uh, what has been your, like, what was one of your biggest sells? Like, what, wh how much did you sell? Like, what was your biggest? Um, I don't know if I should. There was, you know. Go ahead. Yeah. You know. No one watches this show. <laughs> Um, you know, there's been lots of, you know, big amounts of weight. Like hundreds like, of thousands of dollars? Like body weight like $10,000? Yeah. Of uh, cash? Well, no, I'm talking about as far as, you talk about money-wise or weight-wise? Uh, cash. We want to know, like, He's how much? Dollars. Oh, cash-wise. <laughs> yeah. yeah like several fingers of bricks yes. of cash. Yeah, thousands. Like, In piles. Like, I could call myself Mr. Pringles because my chips were stacking. Nice. Oh, yeah. Love that. Yes.